John 10, 17, therefore my father loves me because I lay down my life that I might take it again. No one takes it from me, but I lay it down of myself. I have power to lay it down and I have power to take it again. This command I have received from my father. Lord, and we give you thanks today that no one took your life your life was not taken from you. Lord, you laid your life down for you had the power and the authority to do so, Lord. You laid your life down. You said freely, I will give my life. No greater love is this, Lord, than one who would lay down his life for his friends, Lord. And you said, let me be loud and clear no one is taking my life from me for nobody has the authority to take your life lord but you said i have the authority to lay it down i freely give i freely give i freely give lord what unity you were in with the father for god so loved the world the father so loved the world he gave his son did the father give the son or did the son lay his life down or was the son and the father in perfect unity for you to give your life for you to give your life lord the life you gave 
Lord, for the joy that was set before you, you endured the cross despising the shame. Oh, what joy it was for you to give your life. I just feel this celebration in the atmosphere of heaven that the Lord gave his life. Oh, he gave his life like a gift. feel like if you've had a hard time receiving the love of God, you need to know today he freely gave his life with a smile on his face. For the joy set before him, he endured the cross. For the joy set before him, for the joy set before him, you need to hear the Lord today saying, it was my joy to give my life. It was my joy. I had the authority to lay it down because I had the authority to pick it back up, he said. How is it? Oh, that the Son of Man would lay his life down. A sheep is led by a shepherd. Yes, a sheep is led by a shepherd. A sheep is led by a leader And a son is led by a father Yes Yes And a perfect unblemished sheep He was silently led to the slaughter And our perfect spotless sheep. Yes. You were so humble to follow your father. Yes. So humble. Our sheep was led to the slaughter. Following the voice of his father. Our sheep was led to the slaughter The shepherd became the sheep to be led by his father yes. To lay his life down for his brothers, the other sheep yes. So I follow the voice of my father If it's led to the slaughter What a joy to follow my father if I'm led to the slaughter What a joy to follow my father Even if I'm led to the slaughter What a joy Lord, to follow Lord, you learned obedience by the things you suffered if I'm led to You the learned slaughter. obedience by the things that you suffered, Scripture Teach says Teach me obedience, O shepherd Teach me obedience, good father joy to follow my father even if it leads me to the slaughter to share in your sufferings just to share in your sufferings is this the narrow way the simple life you gave is this the narrow way the simple life you gave is this the narrow gate simple life you gave is this the narrow gate the simple life you gave what a joy to follow my father even if it leads to the slaughter to lay my life down so that he may be revealed to all my other brothers oh i willingly lay my life down just as you did Thank you, Father. Oh, I willingly lay my life down just like the perfect sheep. Is this the narrow gate? The simple life you gave. Is this the narrow gate? The simple life you gave. Is this the narrow gate? The simple life you gave. Thank you that you made the way so simple, way so simple. The 
gate so simple the way so i thank you that the way is simple the gate is narrow jesus i thank you that you made the way so simple the gate so narrow the way so simple the way so narrow i wait the way so simple the gate so narrow i thank you father for the way the truth the life the way is simple to you father to you there's only I thank you that you made the way so simple, the gate so simple, just like a sheep led to the slaughter. This is the way, this is the way, just like a sheep led to the slaughter, led by our Father. This is the way, this is the way, just like a sheep led to the slaughter, led by our Father. Oh, I thank you that you made the way so simple, way so simple, the way so simple, way. I thank you that you Like a sheep led to the slaughter, simply led by his father. Led to the slaughter, simply led by his father. What a joy, what a joy to lay our lives down, 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 down. I'm 
Ezekiel 34, verse 11. If you have your Bibles, we'll pray out of that. <clears throat> Ezekiel 34, 11, it says, For thus says the Lord God, Behold, I myself will search for my sheep and seek them out. As a shepherd cares for his herd in the day, when he is among his scattered sheep, so I will care for my sheep and will deliver them from all the places to which they were scattered on a cloudy and gloomy day. I will bring them out from the peoples and gather them from the countries and bring them in their own land. And I will feed them on the mountains of Israel, by the streams and in all the inhabited places of the land. I will feed them in a good pasture and their grazing ground will be on the mountain heights of Israel. There they will lie down on good grazing ground and feed in rich pastures on the mountains of Israel. I will feed my flock and I will lead them to rest. I will seek the lost, bring back the scattered, bind up the broken and strengthen the sick. But the fat and the strong I will destroy. I will feed them with judgment. As for you, my flock, says the Lord God, behold, I will judge between one sheep and another, between rams and male goats. Lord, we read of your leadership. You are the good shepherd. You are the good shepherd, Lord. We entrust our souls, we entrust ourselves. Lord, we come under your rod, we come under your staff. You are the true shepherd. You lead us in, you lead us out. Lord, we rejoice that we are your sheep. Though once scattered, Lord, we have been made one. Thank you that the God of heaven and earth is described as a shepherd. That you heal us, you bind up our broken places, you feed us with true food. Lord, you know what's best. And Lord, we look to you, we look to your leadership as your sheep. Would you lie us down in green pastures? Would you lead us beside the quiet waters? Would we understand what David understood when he says, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want.
God, thank you that you lead us by your voice as a shepherd. Thank you that sheep don't have to fend for themselves, Lord. That the shepherd protects the sheep, that the shepherd provides for the sheep. Lord, we, we, we simply want to hear your voice. We simply follow your voice, Lord. Your voice is a light, it's a lamb. Your voice is our source. Lord, we find rest under the authority of your voice. Thank you that your voice protects us. Thank you that your voice leads us. Thank you that your voice unifies us, God. Thank you for your voice. That we as your sheep know your voice.
Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. for your staff. Thank you for your oil, Lord. Thank you for your compassion, Lord. You looked among the masses and said they were like sheep without a shepherd. And you came. You gathered us. You healed us. You've led us, Lord. Trust you, Lord. Stop the comfort. I welcome your leadership. Stop the comfort. They keep me from stumbling. You're out in your staff, they comfort. Thank you, Lord. I welcome your leadership. You're out in your staff, they comfort. They keep me from stumbling. Yes, Lord. Lead us. Oh, feed us They comfort me. Give us true drink, Lord. You're the good shepherd. Stop, they comfort me. You're the good shepherd. You're the good shepherd. Stop, they comfort me. You're the good shepherd. Tender, kind, merciful, loving. You're in your staff. They comfort me. Oh, you're the good shepherd. Leader, lead. Love her, love. Comforter, your compassions. Great are your compassions. Great is your faithfulness. You lead us in paths of righteousness, Lord. In the higher ways, Lord. Your voice, Lord. They comfort me, heal us. You're right in your staff, they comfort me. Yes, Jesus. You go after the one. You're right in your staff, they comfort me. Oh, shepherd of Israel. You're right in your staff, they comfort me. You are a good shepherd. Lead us, good shepherd. You lead us in and out. To and fro, here and there, day by day, day by day, heal us day by day. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Lead us day by day. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Good shepherd of my soul. Your rod and your shepherd, they comfort me through the valley. Of the mountain, God. God in your staff, they comfort me. Day by day. Us, day, by day, season after season, Lord. After season, you comfort me. You love us. God in your staff, they comfort me. We trust your rod, Lord. We trust your rod. We trust your staff, Jesus. God in your staff, they comfort me. We trust your leadership. We gather, Lord. Under your care, your 
kindness leads us to repentance. Loving kindness, mercy,
Jesus was going through all the cities and villages, teaching in their synagogue and proclaiming the gospel of the kingdom and healing every kind of disease and every kind of sickness. Seeing the people, he felt compassion for them because they were distressed and dispirited like sheep without a shepherd. Then he said to his disciples, the harvest is plentiful, but the workers are few. Therefore, beseech the Lord of the harvest to send out workers into his harvest. Thank you, Jesus, for having compassion upon the people, those that were dispirited, those that were distressed, Lord. You came to them as a shepherd. You came to them to tend to them, Lord. And in this context, you said the harvest is plentiful, but the workers are few. And so, Lord, we look to the good shepherd. You are the good shepherd. The shepherd who sees the harvest of those that have been scattered, of those that have been disheartened, oh God. And we pray that you would manifest yourself in the earth, Lord. That you would manifest yourself as shepherd. That you would manifest yourself as the shepherd of souls. As the tender of souls. Lord, you are the Lord of the harvest. And Lord, you are the shepherd of the harvest. You are the one that goes after the 99. Lord, we want to receive your heart as a shepherd for harvest. Lord, that we would be sent forth with the message of, message of the shepherd. The one that says, come to me, you who are scattered. Come to me, you who have no food. Come to me, you who are dispirited and disheartened. Come to the shepherd of your souls. Thank you that you go after the 99. Thank you that you leave the flock, Lord, to seek for that which has been lost yet you find it as a shepherd. So I pray, Lord, through this context that there would be a harvest of those that come to the Good Shepherd, of those that come into your flock, and that you would raise up other shepherds that have been sent with your voice to call forth the lost into your flock. Lord, I think of the homosexual community. Lord, I think of those that have deconstructed their faith. I think of those, Lord, that have given their heart to other voices and that your voice would emerge and call them out and call them in, in Jesus' name. You are the shepherd. You are the shepherd of our souls. And so, Lord, we wanna listen and speak what we hear. We want to model, Lord, the one that we found. And as your sheep, would you enable us to be shepherd of lost sheep to your flow, to your flock. In Jesus' name. I once was lost, but now I've found. Because the good shepherd found me. are a good shepherd you are compassionate you are tender you are loving it says Lord that you will whistle you will whistle and you will call the people from afar Lord that you will gather them under the sound of your whistle just believe Lord you're whistling there's a, a noise being sent Lord to call the scattered to call those who are in the dry places, those in the wilderness, those that have not have a shepherd, Lord, I hear the sound of a whistle. Come unto me. Come unto me.
It's Isaiah 5, 26. It says, he will also lift up a standard to the distant nations and he will whistle for it. And from the ends of the earth, they will gather. So Father, we just pray, Lord, for the sound of your voice to go forth, Lord, into the distant nations. Lord, I believe you're coming to upper room as the good shepherd, as the one that leads us, Lord, through the chasm, of God. Lord, that leads us through the transitions. Lord, you're manifesting as the good shepherd, the one in whom we entrust our futures to. Lord, you're leading us into the cedars, God. You're leading us into new pastures. Lord, you're calling us. You're calling us forth. You're calling us, Lord, into new places. You're calling us because you're gonna manifest yourself as the good shepherd to the people of South Dallas. Hey, together, can we, if you can whistle, can we just begin to whistle and in intercession? That might be strange, but it's biblical. <laughs> so let's just begin to whistle like shepherds. To the sheep. says about the good shepherd is it says he anoints my head with oil and the anointing of the oil was to keep the the insects and the parasites from making a nest on the head of the sheep and I want to pray for those of you who you feel like your mind has been wandering you feel like you've had anxious thoughts and you're uh, maybe you're even asking yourself if you've heard the voice of the shepherd and you just feel like you need clarity in the season if that's you would you just raise your hand and if someone has their hand lifted around you, can we, can we circle around them, lay hands on them and pray for them? And I want to declare that, that the good shepherd anoints your head with oil. And so Lord, I thank you for the anointing of oil. Lord, I thank you that you are my shepherd and you anoint my head with oil. Lord, I thank you that, that the ointment that you have, Lord, to rub on our head is an ointment that keeps parasites and, and, and insects, Lord. And, and the buzzings of things away from our head. And so, Lord, I just thank you for a renewed mind. I thank you for the mind of Christ, Lord. I thank you for rest in the mind. Just declare that right now, Lord, today in this moment, you would give rest in the mind to every mind, Lord, that's been in unrest, to every mind that feels like there's been the buzzing, Lord, around them. Lord, I thank you for clarity and direction. Lord, I thank you that your voice is clear. Lord, your voice is clear, your voice is clear. And I just declare that in the clarity of your voice, Lord, it would silence every other voice. It would silence every accusation. It would silence every self-judgment. It would silence, Lord, every other thing that is not you. Lord, I thank you that you anoint my head with oil. I thank you for the anointing, Lord. I thank you for the, the covering, Lord, with your word, the covering with your voice, Lord. I thank you that your voice drowns out every other you anoint my head with oil you anoint our heads with oil you anoint our heads with oil lord there's an, a yes, fragrance god. that comes with the anointing lord that you bring for our heads the covering that thank comes you, lord Jesus. so i thank you for renewed minds Jeez. Jeez. renewed minds lord for you anoint our head with oil Thank you, Lord. I sense the authority of the shepherd. 
There's authority in him being our shepherd. Come to me, all you who are heavy laden, burdened. I will give you rest. I will fend for you. I will defend you. I will provide for you. I will nurture you. I will carry you. I will wash you. I will cleanse you. I will purify you. I will speak to you kindly. I will reveal to you my heart. I am faithful. I am true. I am consistent and steadfast. My love, 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 my love. Receive my love, my love. You are my love. I love you with an everlasting love. I care for you. I'm kind. I'm tender. I'm merciful. I see you. I know you. I formed you. I watch over you. I see your desires. I am the good shepherd. It's more than a theological reality. It's even more than a metaphor. I want to be your shepherd. I want to guide you. I want to care for you. I want to tend to you. You are not alone. Do not be afraid. Do not be afraid. Fix your eyes on me, beloved. I will call you out. I will call you in. I will lead you through the valley. I will lead you up the mountain. I will lead you beside the still waters. I will lay you down. You will find rest for your soul. Hear my voice. Hear my voice. You are my sheep. And I am your shepherd. I will be a light. I will be a lamb. My voice will be your eyes. My voice. My voice. My voice. My voice is your compass. My voice. It is your light. It is your lamp. Come unto me. Come out from them. Come out from other voices. Come out from the noise. Come out from the cluster. Come out. 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 You who have no shepherd. You can have one. Your shepherd is your God. 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 Come out. Come out. That's not a shepherd. This is a shepherd. They're not shepherds. I am your shepherd. Oh, they've been hired. There's been hired hands. Those that have come tending to lead like me but have not been me. Come unto me. Find rest for your soul. Find rest for your soul. Find rest for your soul. There's only one true shepherd. But the shepherd is the one who enters through the gate, who opens up the door. You have a shepherd. You're removing, Lord, the hired hands. You're removing the hired help. You're pruning. You're pruning your flock so that the true shepherd can emerge. So that our only shepherd Ten, ten, ten. You strike the shepherd, the the sheep scatter.
great is his faithfulness. Mighty are you, so deeply in my heart some of you have been wandering you've been in the pasture but you've been wandering I have this image of of a hillside and you're looking at the horizon and you just see this person in the distance who's been calling out and it's a shepherd emerging just over the horizon, you see the, the presence of your shepherd coming towards you. You've been wandering on this hillside and, and he's drawing close the shepherd of your soul with rod and staff in hand. He's led you to this place, but he hasn't left you. He's led you to this place and he's drawing near to continue to lead you upon the heights of the mountains, through the valleys between, your shepherd has prepared the way. And he's coming from afar. And he's drawing you close. And he's saying, oh, little one, come unto the shepherd of your soul. Find rest find protection, find direction. My voice is your compass and my presence is your peace. And although I have not been speaking, I've been drawing near. And my peace, my peace, my peace is sufficient. And my peace will lead you to my voice and my voice will lead you to my peace. It hasn't been about direction, it's been about connection. I'm looking for connection, you're looking for direction, but it's in the connection that you'll find direction. And it's in the peace that you'll find the promise. Let me be me and you be you let the leading be up to me and the following be up to you 
for I'm just looking for sheep that follow day by day, season by season, path by path, twist by twist, up the mountain and down the mountain, through the valley, by the stream. All we know to be is sheep, Lord Jesus. There's deliverance for some of you. You don't have to fend for yourself. Sheep don't provide for themselves. Sheep can't defeat wolves. Sheep just follow their shepherd. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. Oh, he restores my soul. The Lord restores my soul. He, as your shepherd, is restoring your soul. Bye-bye confusion. Bye-bye oppression. Bye-bye heaviness. Bye-bye trying to figure things out. Bye-bye calculating and reasoning. Bye-bye fear. Bye-bye fear. Bye-bye fear, my shepherd is here. Bye-bye fear, my shepherd is here. Bye-bye fear. Bye-bye fear. The good shepherd is here. Come to me, my dear. Receive my oil. I see some of you, he's looking at you and he's saying, oh, you are so weary. I see him picking you up and putting you on his shoulders. guys sing this over you put a smile on your face there's joy there's fullness of joy in his presence in the presence of your shepherd find your smile find your smile I've got this my beloved I've got this my beloved, receive my peace, receive my love. I draw near. My beloved, my beloved, 
my beloved my beloved is mine my beloved is mine under the leadership of the Lord, follow Anne. Just feel like he's calling us under his leadership.
Yes, Lord, we honor you and your leadership. Thank you, Lord, that you're the good shepherd. Lord, I just declare that as we go, we would go following, following your leadership. And so we honor you and we give you thanks today. In Jesus' name we pray, amen.